All right, last section of the game. Again, on easy mode, it's easy. Um, there's a ton of enemies, but hey, I got some bombs. Might as well use them. Um, basically, just get through the level. And then there's another portion of the level. And then you get the final boss. And that's it. That's Star Fox. But again, um, anyone who's never played the game, it does take some practice. Wait, I don't know why I did that. Why did I do that? I didn't need to do that. <laughs> I already had max laser. Um, yeah, it takes practice, it takes time, but it's one of those games that's like really fun, so you don't even mind practicing. <laughs> and like every every playthrough can be a little bit different, so it's got a lot of replay value, so I love it. I need to go back at some point and revisit all the games I've played so far on the channel, and then just from that point on, uh, give like my personal rating for each game. Um, but I'm trying to perfect a system for doing that, and then a better, a best possible way to do that on the channel. We'll see. Anyway, I digress. I'm talking too much about ideas that I haven't even decided on. So anyway, if you all have any di ideas, you know, let me know. But I do, I do want to give each game I play some kind of uh, score. Just my personal opinion, my own two cents, if you will. Incoming! Okay. I know that, like, I think after, I think that's the last time that Rob will help you because he'll send you a signal, but it, you'll you'll find out it's not really uh, it's not really him talking to you. So I'm not gonna click the button anymore because I think it's at this point it's just gonna be like Andros talking to you, and all he does is taunt you and say ha ha you go die boy and uh he basically he basically just tries to make your life a living hell even in his taunts and his crappy dialogue well they all have crappy dialogue so i'm not gonna take it all out on him but anyway i'm not gonna <laughs> this brings back memories of your dad and i can just see oh no see this is the part where like they want you to click it so you can listen to andros stupid dumbass but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna give him the satisfaction I'm not going to give you the satisfaction, Andros. Okay. Yeah, but it's kind of funny, like, when, when Peppy makes that comment, like, this this brings memories of your dad and stuff like that. I bet Fox is, like, he's, like, tearing there. Like, <laughs> like you just see, like, a single tear come from his eye. <laughs> like, fuck you, Peppy. <laughs> you asshole. Stop bringing that crap up, man. This is not something to be celebrated. We are trying to save the world from an evil ape mastermind. This dude, not particularly hard, but you just gotta like really pay attention to the level. Don't get crushed. Shoot his undies. Shoot his shoulders. Shoot his head. All that jazz. Woo! I already taken some good health off of him. I'm gonna try to zoom a little bit or boost, if you will. Oh! Whoa! All right, got nice and close there. So basically all you're doing is taking out his armor until there's no more armor left to take out and then you shoot him in the head. And you just shoot him in the head. And you just shoot him and you shoot him and you shoot him until he's dead. And I think, is he almost dead? He's not dead yet. Oh, snap. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> I have to do another cycle of dodging. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, I lost my wing. No, I lost my wing! Oh, and I missed the wing repair. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. <laughs> I have to do this without a wing? Well, I'm probably going to get my wing repair, but I'm going to have to do this with, like, one laser. Fortunately, this is the easiest Andros. So, we'll see how that goes. Oh, crap. If I can't do it this first time, I should be able to do it for sure the second time, because at least... Yeah, 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 you've been waiting for me. Because at least the second time, I, <laughs> I'll have, like, maybe a double laser, which would be nice. 
Alright, well, I gotta get some health here. Oh! Okay, I guess you have to shoot the thing. <laughs> Maybe I should die on purpose, just for the sake of, uh, making things a little easier. Okay, so yeah, that, that, that last portion did not go to plan. But at least I got my wing back. But I have, like, very little health. So we'll, we'll see how well I do here. A little extra health and a double laser, I'll take it. So here we go, this is Andros. Let's see how well I can handle this <laughs> with minimal health and uh, try not to take so much damage. Here we go. Alright, so you basically go for his eyes, shoot up his hands, and he's gonna do that attack. So yeah, you shoot him in the eye. And you shoot his other hand. And... Oh, didn't do it in time. So I'm going to shoot his eye more. And shoot his hand. Oh, crap. And not kill him a time again. <laughs> oh, I think I can do this. I don't know. I, I don't remember. Okay. So now you just shoot him in the head until he complains like he's doing right now. Now he's going to do this. Gonna turn into a robot, so you gotta dodge him. And I just threw a bomb at him. I'm gonna throw another bomb at you. And you dodge him. I actually can handle this. Oh, thought I'd have a little more trouble. I just threw a third bomb, and he's freaking dead, fools. I don't know how I pulled that off. <laughs> so I did. I did this whole mode without dying a single time. For that, I will take it unpracticed. I know it's easy mode, but still, I almost died in Titania, and then I almost died here in Venom. But, no deaths! So I'll take it. That won't be the case for medium... Well, maybe it could be the case for medium, but most likely, I'll die at least once, and then I'll die multiple times in hard. We'll see how that goes. And, on even the best part about my accomplishment here today was that um, none of my allies died. So <laughs> there were times there were times where Pepe and Falco were almost out of commission but uh, no, we, we managed. We, we toughened through this easy mode <laughs> of Star Fox. Which even though it was easy coming back rusty was still challenging. So I must say that. Shigeru Miyamoto, thank you for being responsible to an extent for this game. Um, I'm not going to say he's not completely responsible because there were a lot of amazing people involved in this game. Um, but anyway, I digress. That is Star Fox 64, fellas. And... Um, there are more levels to play. I don't know that I'm going to jump right in right away and tackle those, but hey, by the time by the time this video gets posted, who knows? Maybe I maybe I will. I'm um, hoping that I can uh, get through the rest of this game because uh, I had some trouble uh, with my audio uh, last time I tried. So I tried I tried playing this. Um, and I had some audio troubles like in the middle of like level one or level two I should say so I had to re redo this project uh, um, But everything's been running smoothly so far across my fingers at least we got through most of the game here or We got through the game. Just got to get through the credits so basically uh, great Fox is uh, It has returned to corn area and Everybody happy everybody happy everybody peaceful Everybody's having a good time. So, um, yeah. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah. Yeah. So, Great Fox lands, and we see. Star Fox approach approaching Star Fox, we 
are in your debt. I would be honored to have you as part of the Cornerian... Oh, no, sir. We prefer doing things our own way. Great Fox is ready to go. It's time for us to go now. All right. And we have some more credits here. Uh, this game is very fulfilling. Um, it can be stressful. Um, it can, it's very exhilarating. Um, there are times when you're like, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. And then there's times when you're just taking out enemies and you're just feeling really good. Um, it's it can be a roller coaster ride depending on how things progress but it is awesome very very fun L like I said before a lot of replay value um, I mean I, I could like sit here and give you like my unofficial rating of the game um, out of whether I don't like it like it or love it it's a love it so we'll give it two points there. Uh, does it have replay value? It does. So I'll give it a point there. Does it have great music? It does. I'll give it a point there. Um, does it control well? It does. Is it challenging but fair? It is. So I'll give you s some more points there. What are we at? Like seven points? Yeah. I mean, I I'll give it... <laughs> I'll give it another three points just for the hell of it. Again, I I'm trying to come up with like a rating system. Uh, I'm kind of on the verge of it, but this probably would get a full score for me. Um, there's not really much I can complain about in the game. And, uh, I mean, if I do complain about something, really, it's just me nitpicking. Like, I have to think really hard about something I don't like about this game, so... That's saying something. Don't mess with it. If it's a great game, it's a great game. Just leave it at that. But don't, don't, you know, don't just take my word for it. If you haven't played the game, pick it up. It's awesome. And here's the last little segment right here. So we still hear the laugh of Andros, and uh, it tells you maybe we haven't quite gotten the best ending here. And I can tell you we haven't. <laughs> uh. <laughs> So, I don't know who Gab is. I seriously don't. I'm starting to think this is not my copy of Star Fox, because I don't know who this Gab is. But Gab sure has taken the, the top 10 ratings. Yeah, you know what? I think my copy was the... I have two copies of this game, I'll be honest. And I think mine is the other copy. So whoever this Gab guy is, well done, man. Well done. You, got all, you, you went through the trouble to get all those medals and got everything. Man, hey, I'm glad you enjoyed the game, man. Well done. How many hits did I have? Like 800-something? So in order to beat Gab's lowest score of the top 10, I would have to kill a few more enemies. But anyway. This is one steep bill, but it's worth it. Yeah, 853 enemies. Again, wasn't going for high kill counts. Wasn't really thinking about that too much. But that's the invoice. Made a good $54,000. I feel like I should be making more for saving the whole freaking galaxy. But whatever. I'll take it. Well, I have to split that four ways. So, you know what? Never mind. That's a ripoff. Anyway, that's Star Fox 64, my friends. I thank you so much for watching. Um... I think I'm going to come back to this and play the medium route and then the hard route, but in case I ever decide not to play it, uh, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope you'll, uh, if you, if I don't end up playing it and you really want to see me play it, you know, let me know in the comments, like, let me know, hey, you should really continue this and play the other levels, like, or like, we want to watch you or whatever, this or that, you know, if you show your support, you know, I'll, I'll follow up with it, but, uh, as 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 eh, I cannot talk. Uh, for the time being, my plan is to uh, go ahead and proceed and play all three modes. So we'll see what happens.
But anyway, Star Fox 64, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate uh, all your support, and I appreciate constructive criticism as well. Uh, feel free to leave that in the comments. Until next time, you take care of yourself, my f my my fellow YouTubers, and uh, you take it easy. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.